Hello everyone. As you can see, I have a request to test a game at a lower TDP of 15 watts. There's a rumor stating that AMD drivers are unstable at lower TDP levels. Today, I will test this across all TDP options in the Legion settings to see if it's true. Let's get started. In the Legion settings, under the Thermal Mode TDP section, there are four TDP options to choose from. Quiet Mode sets the TDP to 8 watts, Balance Mode sets it to 15 watts, and Performance Mode sets it to 20 watts. In Custom Mode, you can set the TDP anywhere from 5 watts to 30 watts, based on your preference. I will test these TDP options to see if the device runs accurately with the latest AMD driver. I also tested it while using AFMF2. In the per game settings, I set AFMF2 to high in quality, combined with Radeon anti lag. I enabled integer scaling at full panel, set Radeon image sharpening to 90% sharpness, set texture filtering quality to performance, enabled surface optimization, and set tessellation mode to override at 2x. Today, I'm testing Assassin's Creed Origins. The game is running at 1280 by 800 resolution on high settings, with all the AMD adrenaline features I mentioned earlier. First, I ran the device in quiet mode, which the power limit set to 8 watts. Using RevaTuner, I observed that the power draw remained consistently locked at 8 watts throughout gameplay. This demonstrates that the AMD driver effectively manages performance while staying within the set power limit, ensuring stable operation and optimal efficiency. Next, I set the Legion's power mode to balance with a 15-watt TDP limit. Initially, the device spiked to around 25 watts to maintain performance, but then gradually adjusted based on thermal or power limits and ultimately stabilized and locked at 15 watts. This further demonstrates that the AMD driver provides stable TDP adjustments and ensures consistent performance under Legion's power settings. Non dio, Next, I switched the Legion's power mode to performance with a 20 watt TDP limit. Initially, the device spiked to around 27 watts to sustain performance, but then gradually adjusted according to thermal and power limits, eventually stabilizing and locking at 20 watts. This further shows that the AMD driver delivers stable TDP management, ensuring consistent performance under the Legion's power settings. Next, I ran the device in custom mode with the power limit set to 30 watts. Using RevaTuner, I monitored the power draw, which remained consistently locked at 30 watts throughout gameplay. This highlights that the AMD driver effectively manages power consumption, ensuring stable performance while adhering to the set power limit. Hey, you're quick, 
Next, I tested the device in custom mode with the power limit configured to 25 watts. Monitoring the power draw with Riva Tuner, I observed it remained consistently locked at 25 watts during gameplay. This demonstrates the AMD driver effectively regulate power consumption, providing stable performance while maintaining the specified power limit. In conclusion, installing the AMD driver properly, using tools like DDU Display Driver Uninstaller for a clean installation, does not interfere with the TDP limit functionality provided by Legion settings. Regardless of whether you set a low or high TDP, the device effectively adjusts its power consumption to match the configured limit. For the best results, it is advisable to set the desired TDP before launching a game. This allows the system to adjust more accurately. However, if you change the TDP setting mid-game, as demonstrated in my tests, the adjustment may take some time. For instance, when switching to balance mode with a 15-watt or 20-watt TDP, the system required approximately 30 seconds to stabilize and lock into the newly set TDP. This delay is due to the device dynamically managing power and thermal limits to maintain optimal performance. Overall, the AMD driver proves to be highly reliable in managing TDP settings, even at lower power limits such as 15 watts. It ensures stable performance across a range of power configurations. That's it for today. Thank you for watching.